Welcome to my opinion here on My Opinion TV. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the notification bell so as soon as the video is released, you'll be one of the first to be notified. And this morning, upon the hearing of my voice, you have so much to give God thanks for this morning. The fact that you're alive means it's time to give God thanks. So many people went to bed last night with the dreams and aspiration of getting up this morning and did not make it. So as long as you're living, whether you're struggling or not healthy, but your eyes are open and you're hearing and you're seeing, give God thanks. Now, the government of Jamaica are proposing that criminals who are behind bars who consistently flout the law of using cell phones are in, will be in for a raw deal. Now, According to Loop, and I read, five more years, that is the additional time incarcerated persons could face behind bars if they are caught with a cell phone, if a bill that is before Parliament is passed. National Security Minister Dr. Horace Chang on Tuesday opened a debate on the, Cor the Corrections Amendment Act of 2021. Now, we all know what's taking place behind bars and the use of cell phones has been widespread with 5,431 illicit phones seized in the nation's prison between 2016 to 2017 and 2019 to 2020. That's what Dr. Horace Chang told the house. Now, for those convicted in the, according to the bill, person convicted in the parish court may be fined up to $3 million or in prison for three years, while a second or subsequent offense will attract a fine of $5 million or five years imprisonment. For those convicted in the circuit court, the term of imprisonment is a maximum seven years for a first offense and 15 years for a second offense. Now, if you use a cell phone or any form of electronic device and you send an instruction out the road and cause things to happen you are going to be punished that's what the government are saying well this is a welcome sign and this is a step in the right direction because too many criminals are behind bars and directing traffic outside they get people killed they extort they send their command they live a lavish lifestyle they stay wherever they it's like you're in prison, but you still have freedom. Prison should never be the place where people have access to certain things. And I would go as far as saying some of these criminals who are convicted of murder should not even have visit. That's how drastic the law should be. Because guess what? We have to face the reality. We are living in changing times. And these criminals are hell-bent on trying to corrupt society, destroy lives and property, and if we don't send a strong message to them, it will be business as usual. The other correction in this act should also be for the correctional officers who take in contraband to these prisoners. If they are caught, they should be slapped even harder than the prisoner because people's lives are being lost. How can a man be in behind bars and dictate who lives and who dies? How could a man be behind bars dictate how much money he must get, who must send this, and if they don't send it, the person must die? It makes no sense. Might as well the person was, was outside doing their business because they direct traffic from behind the bars. Well, we have seen Anjouni speaking tough recently, and we have seen this law that they are trying to pass into being. We hope the opposition will not be too strident against it because, listen, education, crime, and health are three things that must never be politicized. Never. It affects every single person. And crime in Jamaica is rampant and these criminals are way ahead of the laws that we had once. We have to have laws that are keeping with the time. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the notification bell. So as soon as a video is released, you'll be one of the first to be notified. Until next time, stay safe. Look out for a neighbor, look out for a loved one. And most of all, look out for the children. 
And most of all, keep it locked on My Opinion TV.